Hello all. So uh, after a break, uh, I came up with a new part of Android penetration testing series. And in today's video, uh, this video will a little bit small in duration as I will be sharing some device requirement to start with the penetration testing of uh, Android application. So let's get started. Okay, so for device requirement, uh, like specifically for Android penetration testing, the operating system you're going to use is Windows 10, Windows 11, whatever suits you, uh, with Kali Linux, Parrot OS, and MacBook. And uh, like system configuration, the only main configuration which we have to focus on is like uh, 16 GB RAM or more. That would be a great uh, configuration. And if you have 8 GB RAM, then th that is also fine. Uh, like your storage will be uh, 250 uh, plus gigs. And for the Android uh, architecture or Android images or uh, Android phone for virtual uh, like accessing to your uh, laptop only, then you can use emulators like uh, Android Studio, Memo Player, um, Jenny Motion, uh, which is a great tool again uh, to provide you the interface of Android. And if you want to use uh, like physical device that you have already rooted, uh, then you can uh, just connect your uh, mobile or the physical device uh, using a USB cable to your laptop and uh, you can use that also. So there is a pr uh, pro tip. So it is not hard as that uh, of uh, rocket science, but you can use uh, a power mirror tool, which is uh, which is a great tool again, which is supported to the windows and uh, uh, you can uh, actually mirror your uh, physical device screen to your laptop so that you can uh, easily access your physical rooted device in order to perform any uh, penetration testing for Android application. Let me show you uh, a, a bit about uh, that application. So if you if you see my screen, this is my uh, mobile device which is connected through the A power mirror. So it is it is a um, uh, like it is my uh, application which is which sync that uh, physical device to my laptop using the A power mirror tool. And if you can see here, uh, I have installed all the required tools that may be required or that is required at the time of Android penetration testing for any of the APK. So suppose uh, let's let's talk about Freda. So it is also available uh, on like on the repository itself. So you can just download the required uh, required server version and then you can just inst uh, install and then run the particular FIDA server for the same. Make sure your architecture will be the same and uh, we, we will uh, discuss these, uh, these system or the application requirement in the later uh, series. And if you can see, I can access each and every application on my, uh, on my physical device. And uh, if I check like my phone is rooted or not, then uh, I'll just click on verify root and then congratulations, root access is properly installed on this device. So let me show you my device. So this is the device which I have rooted. This is MI Note 4 and uh, it is a bit easy to uh, root this uh, device and uh, you can access this device as uh, uh, like the, you can mirror this uh, whole screen or whole uh, screen of your uh, physical device to the a power mirror uh, uh, tool and you can easily access uh, the the mobile phone over this uh, device over this device where you are going to test your applications and uh, that's it uh, that's it this is the complete tool and you can do form each and every action uh, over there and uh, it is completely uh, easy Okay, so that's all for today and uh, see you on the next chapter of this series. Bye-bye.